Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about the best jeans. So for me personally, jean shopping can be a little bit tough. I look for length, I look for quality, and I look for color typically when I buy jeans. And through a lot of trial and error, I think I found some pretty good options. So the first pair of jeans I wanna show you guys is going to be the Zara full length jeans. I love these jeans. I feel like they fit perfectly. They're the perfect amount of high waist. I love that they really cinch you in towards your waist and then I love the length on them. They go all the way down to my foot. I could wear them with heels or I could wear them with sneakers. It's a little bit of a step away from just the normal plain skinny jean and it just gives a little more flavor and spice to regular outfits. They're also 100% cotton so I know that they'll last me a long time and that they'll also wear in and start to fit to my body a little bit more the more I wear them. I bought these jeans in black as well because I just was so obsessed with the light pair. These fit just as good as the lighter wash ones do and they're the same good quality. The black pair is also a really good substitute for that wide leg leather trend pant that we really can't get away with in warmer weather. The next pair of jeans I have is a pair of 505 Levi's that I found on eBay. This has quickly become one of my favorite pair of jeans that I have overall. They just have so much character. They have this patch that was like taken off and sewn back on. They have some distressing in the front. They have like typical jean wear stains on them. They have this nice fading in the back and other worn areas on them. They go pretty far down on my legs so the length is spectacular and I'm just so glad that I was able to find them for a reasonable price. I feel like these are now one of my favorite pairs of jeans. They just fit so good. Next up, I have another pair of Levi's. These are the 501 straight leg jeans and I love these jeans because they're a break from the normal skinny. I love the straight leg silhouette. I also was able to get these in a longer length and they fit perfectly. They have the button fly in the front and they're distress free. So it makes them a really clean jean that you can dress up or dress down. I'm still working on these. I'm still working them in. I haven't worn them enough for them to completely shade to my body. So I still have a little more breaking in to do for these, but they are a really, really good fit. I also have these 501s in a darker color with a little distressing at the knees. I really do love the Levi 501s because of their shape and their comfortability. They really just give me a vintage feel and I love the quality and stiffness of the denim. Next up, I have the Topshop Mom Jean. This is a mom skinny fit at the bottom with a really, really high waist. And I actually really like these jeans. I feel like they look perfect with all my dad's shoe outfits. That's usually what I wear them with. They are just a really nice, light wash denim and i really am into them i did actually have to get these tailored i got the waist tailored and i also got the ankle tailored i've actually worn these a lot so they're slowly starting to feel more worn in and just a lot more comfortable originally when i got them i literally couldn't even eat because i was like <sighs> but now they fit really good and i really really like them i get a ton of wear out of these next up i got a boot cut pair of jeans from zara and these actually are a full length pair of boot cut jeans from them they go all the way down to my ankles and they are the perfect fit again stepping away from more of like the skinny jean and going towards something a little more loose and relaxed these are a great fit and they're one of the few jeans i have that is in a darker wash i actually really like them they keep the distressing to a minimum there's just a little bit of detailing on the pockets and around the foot and they overall snatch your weight. The next pair of jeans I have is these Sophie jeans from A Gold or A Goldie. I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but I actually love these Sophie jeans. These jeans fit like a glove and I think they make everyone's butt look good. They're a great quality, but they still feel really soft. They're definitely a more expensive pair of jean, but if you can catch them at a good sale price like I did, I definitely think they're worth it. These actually are the perfect summer pair of jeans. They're not super shorts, but they're also not all the way down to my ankle. They come to a really nice length that looks really good with heels. Next is probably my most worn pair of jeans, and that is the Mile High jeans from Levi's. Everyone needs a good pair of black jeans in their closet. That's like the number one closet essential, and these are my go-to pair. The fit is amazing on these. A lot of my jeans are from Levi's because I can choose the length. They really are the perfect, most flexible pair of jeans that I have, and they really look good with anything I put them with because they're just a classic black pair of jeans. 
The next pair of jeans I have is the Looker jean from Mother and I actually really like these jeans. They are the perfect fit. They actually have a pretty good length and they are one of the few jeans I have that is a darker blue wash. They have the signature Mother M detailing on the back pockets and they don't have any distressing which makes them really just a clean jean. They look really good with more dressed up elevated jeans looks that I need to wear to anything a little more fancy. They're perfect for that and they just look really nice. They have a really good... Next up, I have these Levi's 721 blue jeans. They just are really figure flattering and they're a great material, so it doesn't hug you in the wrong places. They're not super skinny at the ends, but overall, I think they fit great. Also, the price point on Levi's is pretty good. If you are able to catch a sale or use a student discount, you really can get a pair for like $40, which is pretty good for a pair of jeans. Next, I have another pair of the Zara Premium Vintage Skinnies, and these are in a lighter wash. I love these jeans. I feel like they really look nice from day to night, from dressier to more casual. They're just a really simple, everyday, basic pair of jeans that I feel like everyone needs. I also purchased these in black because they're just a staple pair of jeans. This next pair of jeans is a pair of Levi's 710s Super Skinny, and these jeans were really my ride or die to the point where I actually busted through them and had to get them tailored. So they have this nice patch right here where I ripped them and got them repaired. I don't know why, but these jeans are really, really figure flattering. They make your shape look really, really nice and they have the perfect length to them. They go all the way down to my ankle. At this point, I don't wear them as much because I bursted the holes out, but if you can get your hands on a pair of 710s, they are the perfect pair of Levi's. Well, that's it guys. Those are my recommendations for the best jeans. I feel like everyone needs a combination of these jeans in your closet. They're just the perfect basics that really complete your outfit. Hopefully this really did help you out a little bit and gave you some insight into what I look for in jeans and some of the places I found the best jeans from. Thank you so much for watching. As always, don't forget to drop a comment and let me know if you have any of these jeans or if you enjoyed any of them. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe. Stop back by next week. I drop a video every week and I would hate for you to miss something new.